top international and Ethiopian fashion designers and models converged in Addis Ababa for this year's African Mosaic Fashion Fair. The event provided designers an opportunity to showcase some of their elaborate and colorful creations to the adoring public. According to the founder of the annual event, fashion in Africa is still lagging behind and requires support in order to create opportunities for the teeming unemployed youth. Well, African Mosaic is many things. It's a platform for designers to showcase collectively designers of African origin from the diaspora. It is um, a platform to promote um, new and emerging designers as well. It's also a fundraising vehicle for ECF Children's Fund. And now it is, um, we are um, developing a design center in Ethiopia. So it is um, a fully integrated design center. So it has been going on now for 15 years, but also internationally, we have been showcasing in Paris and New York at the beginning and different parts of Africa. And, um, but every year it's an annual benefit show. Kitane, who first hit the international catwalks in the 90s, became a household name in the country and on the continent. Having rubbed shoulders with the best in international fashion, it is befitting that she initiated such a glamorous event. A noble spin-off of the event is that it also raises funds for the charity, the Ethiopian Children's Fund, which schools more than 500 orphans and destitute children. Lola Faturotti, a Nigerian designer based in New York, was among the many who took part in the fashion extravaganza. African fashion is taking over the world, I have to say. You know, from Nigerian designers, from um, Ghanaian designers, you know, Ethiopian designers. Yes, they are, they are taking over. They're getting noticed big time. I'm from New York and I know how, how widely they, <coughs> the African designers have been noticed. In recent years, Africa has produced some of the world's leading designers who today ply their trade in Europe and America. Famous names such as Nigeria's Chris Ire and Ghanaian Oswald Boateng are just a few who have managed to break into the international fashion arena with many more eager to follow in their footsteps. Maria Galang, CCTV.